is this? Do you know what that role is for? Fawn Hall tells all. Do you know what that role is for? Oh, look at... She's got a white powdery nose. Look at her huge pupils. Look at that big smile. Got a little... Straw action happening with the money. That's why a huge percentage of cash has traces of cocaine or used to anyway. And you got the white nose, huge pupils, and a big smile. Look, look into the camera. Fawn Hall tells all. Who's Fawn Hall? Card number 32. Crimes and misdemeanors. Fawn Hall recently admitted to Drug Enforcement Administration sources who interviewed her during a drug investigation in Washington, D.C., that while serving as Oliver North's personal secretary from 1985 to 1987, she was a weekend cocaine user. North was the Reagan administration's point man in aiding the Nicaraguan Contras, one of whose leaders, Arturo Ru Ruiz Jr., was dating Hall at the time. As is now known, the Contras and their American handlers were up to their necks in cocaine smuggling. Though North was never uh, prosecuted for his, for his part in the Drugs for Guns conspiracy, he was convicted on lesser charges and sentenced, ironically, to spend 1,000 hours educating teens on the dangers of drug use. Compare this to the case of Washington, D.C.'s black ex-mayor, Marion Barry. Barry was arrested on January 18, 1990, after being lured by an ex-girlfriend to her hotel room where hidden, camera, hidden video cameras recorded Barry smoking crack cocaine supplied by the FBI for the sting. The 51-minute tape shows that the woman coaxed Barry into lighting up while spur spurning his sexual advances. Barry's lawyers claimed that their client had been an FBI target for eight years, during which time agents went through his credit card bills, staked out his house, monitored his bank account, and checked his tax returns. And moreover, that the government had spent $440 million over a 10-year period for sting operations against other black politicians like Julian Bond and Andrew Young. Though the jury found Barry guilty of only one misdemeanor charge, his public career is ruined while North does GOP fundraisers and sells bulletproof vests and Hall, and Hall is training to be a newscaster. Wow. Wow. And compare this to the present, right? I know this video is going on censor too, but compare this to the present with HB videos coming out, right? Just a troubled boy. Fawn Hall tells all. Look at that 80s hair. Big hair, big hair. Cocaine hair. That's...